On January 31st, Earth could witness the power of the cosmos. A colossal coronal hole, nearly 500,000 miles wide, has opened on the sun's surface, blasting high-speed solar wind directly toward our planet. This coronal hole is a massive region where the sun's magnetic fields have opened up, unleashing solar wind into the vastness of space. Measuring over 62 times the diameter of Earth, it's a reminder of the sun's raw, untamed power. The solar wind escaping from this hole is traveling at staggering speeds, over 310 miles per second. Scientists predict that this solar storm will reach Earth by January 31st, 2025, creating the potential for minor geomagnetic activity rated at a G1 level. What are these G levels? To put it in perspective, NOAA classifies geomagnetic storms on a G scale, ranging from G1, minor, to G5, extreme. While G1 storms are relatively common, they still provide an astonishing opportunity to witness the auroras in action. A G1 geomagnetic storm might not sound extreme, but it can intensify auroras, making them more vibrant and widespread. The charged particles from the sun will collide with gases in Earth's upper atmosphere, causing oxygen and nitrogen to release energy as light. It will result in stunning displays of the northern and southern lights, especially visible at higher latitudes. But remember, space weather is as unpredictable as Earth's weather. Even though January 31st holds promise, geomagnetic storm warnings at this level sometimes amount to nothing. That said, it's always better to be prepared for the possibility of nature's light show. Mark your calendars, January 31st. The sun is sending its message to Earth. <laughs>